Hi guys and welcome back. I hope all of you are doing well. Today I'm going to share with you a little tip around how to use donut charts. Donut charts are very easy to make. However, sometimes it's a little tricky to include two parameters in that. For example, you have sale and you have margin as well. So how you are going to do that? Let's move on and look at our Excel spreadsheet. So in our spreadsheet, as you can see, there is a profit margin and the sales and sales and margin levels are quite different for, let's say, all of these four products. So how we can include it? Let's have a look. First of all, select the data which you want to include in the donut chart. Then there is insert menu and insert you have charts menu. If you open the charts menu, you will find so many options, all chart options. In the chart options, you will find um, pie charts. And when you move into the pie charts, you will find donut charts as well. So select the donut charts from here, click on OK. Once you select OK, now you are able to see the donut chart, which actually, if I click onto, for example, the legends and data labels, you will see the values. And these values are primarily around the sale that you have. So this sale is not enough for me because I want to see the overall picture of sales and profit both. So first thing, right click on the chart and select data. Click on that. When you click on the select data, you should be able to include profits as well in this and then press OK. Now, our picture is pretty much ready when it comes to the profit and sales. And you can see sale and profit is pretty much different in both the cases. So how we can further make it a little bit more presentable, click on the plus sign and there you can find the titles. Click on the title and you can add any sort of title. But I will move on to, uh, let's say, the purification of this chart first. And there you have many options. For example, this option is good and viable. I can see and show as well uh, percentages or this one is also very beautiful. Uh, this is pretty restricted and, and this one is also quite nice. So depending on the selection of your charts, you can pick up any of these data types and you can also select the colors as well. For example, from here, you can pick up different sort of colors for your chart. So once it is selected, now you can see it is presenting both uh, your values and percentages as well to give you a highlight that how much percentage each one of these uh, types of businesses have got. So for example, you can see here, it is it is demonstrating 17% uh, with the three sales, three million sales, for example. And you can see also uh, overall percentage of the business. So this gives a beautiful look. You can play with the format of um, these, these charts. For example, you can pull in the uh, guideline and now it's a little bit more, let's say, uh, highlighted. I can click here as well. So now it gives a little bit more of a beautiful view. You can change different types of formatting from, from these designs as well. So you can select from here, multiple designs, color schemes, layouts also. You can play with the layout as well. For example, you want to keep it simple. You can keep it like this. You can keep it like this as well or like this. So this is the selection and choice you would like to make. So I hope fellows you have learned how to make a double donut chart. Please practice it and do share your comments in the comment section. I look forward to speak to you again. Until then, my friends, take very good care of yourself. Ta-da. If you still didn't subscribe my channel, please do it. And don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you can get regularly notifications from my new videos.